Good morning, everybody. It's Lynn from A Bit of Birdsong. I have just a few minutes before I go to work this morning. Whoa, don't spill. And I wanted to switch gears a little bit. I know not everyone is into Halloween. I think we have varying levels of being into Halloween. I love the colors. I love fall. And let me tell you what, I came outside this morning and I had to go back in and get a flannel shirt because it's cool this morning. Wait, let me see. This is the temperature outside. It's currently 60 degrees. 60, do you hear that? It feels cold. It was 96 a couple of days ago. That's 36 degrees difference. Anyway, it feels so good out here this morning. So good. I have some trash pieces that I wanna put into the trash journal and maybe a few things that are not trash. This journal is just so much fun. I know one thing, I want the bananas that are on here. I'm gonna be using the coupons, the ones that are still active. I don't have too long before I have to run out the door, but it feels so good out here this morning. It's amazing. It's just, it's fall. It feels like fall, and I don't know. I'm really excited about that. All right, bananas and tomatoes. I like bananas and tomatoes. I like tomato sandwiches and I like banana sandwiches. Banana and mayonnaise or banana and peanut butter, but I don't like banana and peanut butter as much as I used to. I don't know why. I think our taste changes when we get older. So let's just flip quickly and you can see how these pages are so far. Love the way that they are turning out. There's more trash stuck in there. That needs to be permanently put into the book. I just love it. Definitely a fun, fun project, and I highly recommend it to anyone who wants to evaluate how much they're spending on convenience or how much they are putting into their recycle bins. I don't really think about it. I put stuff in the recycle bin. When the recycle bin is full, I take it out. And you know, it's easy to forget all of the steps that are involved in processing this huge amount of paper and plastic that we use. And I say that being fully aware that I love labels. I just think that labels and packaging do sell things. I knew this was going to be a massive journal. And it is. Next time I won't put quite so many pages in. I kind of out, outdid myself here on the number of pages. And I think I'm going to go ahead and glue a couple more pages together near the back. Let's see, we really don't have that many left. So let's go all the way back here and glue these together. I'm just gonna put a thin strip around the edge. Oh, the wind is blowing. It looks a bit cloudy. There's that. In the back, I sewed down this recycle fabric collage that I had made to take in for a display and I just decided to put it in the trash journal. So that that's gonna cut down on the size a little bit. I think I will do glue another couple of pages together. I'm gonna put tabs on these last three sections for sure so that I'm not trying to, to peel those pages apart. I had this left over from when I made my butterfly journal and I really want to have a piece of this in this journal you can add things to your trash journal to just really spice it up. Nothing wrong with that. So we get these flyers or sales books from Whole Foods, and I know I want to use a lot of images from these. I have been, well, I've kind of been overdoing it. I love to make popcorn on the stove top and use real butter and sea salt. And I've been doing that every night lately. So I know I want the popcorn in here. I'd love to do just even a little bit. Oh goodness, 
So I got two sheets. Well, I'm going to go ahead and use it. Let's put that there, and then I hope I didn't get three sheets. I don't think I did. I'll just put two things on there. I said I was going to do some tabs. Let's go back here. We will use this paper. I love this is the paper I did on my October Daily yesterday where you crinkle up the paper and use the ink pad. I really like this side better than this side. It's pretty. It's more, um, it's lighter, but you can still see the design. So let's see. I'm going to put a tab here using this. This is perfect. I have enough for three tabs, and I'm going to put... And I'm going to put one here. Yep, that's it. I'll move that one in a little bit so it kind of overlaps onto that. Let's make a little note beside the popcorn. So there's that. I have some other things I want to put in. I've got a little bag here. It's a sample. Counterculture coffee has this product. I don't know if it's new. I, it's really, really good. It's a, like a tea bag, but it's coffee. And I was given a sample by someone. Let's just put that on the page. Oh, this should be funny. Hmm. I normally like to sew the plastic bags into place because glue does not always hold them down properly. But guess what? We're gonna try the tacky glue, and if it doesn't hold, I will go back later with the sewing machine. But I know that I want one of these in here. I, I love to curl my hair sometimes using these pink rollers, and I haven't had any in years. And I bought some the other day while I was out, and I just I love them. I think we need some sort of image in there, and you know, I may have found the perfect thing. Yep, she can go right in there. And I think I will put just a little piece, a little piece, a little strip of glue across the top to hold this in place. And I really hope this is going to stick. If not, we will come up with another way to keep it in there. Ooh, I love being able to do this a little bit before I go to work. It's very therapeutic. Another thing I love, tights. I love tights. And I really like lace tights because they keep my legs covered, but at the same time, they let my, my skin breathe at work. Um, it would be so hot to be wearing just like heavy tights. But I do like to keep my legs covered. I don't know. I don't want to bring age into it, but I'll, for me, for myself, especially at my age. So, and these are pretty, but again, they keep my legs covered. So, so that's that. Let's put the bananas in. I gotta keep up with the time. Ooh, I need to go. I'm gonna set this book on the table just because it's covering my little trash can right now and I need to have access to it. Mmm, Subway. That is another thing. So, sometimes at night, when I get home from work, if Jason and I both have had really busy days, we've got a Subway not too far away, and it is so nice to get a salad or a sub, and they've got some good cookies in there. That's all I'm going to say about that. I've got time to do one more little thing. I think I've mentioned before, I love it when the packaging has these little, um, like it makes like a frame, you know, they fix it so you can see the product underneath. Okay, that's fun. We need a really cool image to go underneath. That's kind of cute, but I really want this whole sticker in here. This was a sticker from work. I guess, so what does this say? Practice some tonight. Ooh. Blackened Voodoo, Crimson Voodoo, Other Beers Beware. I guess it's some sort of beer. I have not had any of this. This is just a sticker that was at work, and I bought it when I purchased some things because I love the colors. Oh, I have just the picture. 
Look at that pink phone. I might leave that phone sticking out there a little bit and then just put the frame. That's okay, right? Because I can do it however I want to since it's my journal. Don't you like that power? Oh, I don't want to stop, but I have to, and I shouldn't say that. I love my job. Is anybody sick of hearing me say that? This is such a creative place where I work, and it makes my heart happy. Okay, I definitely have to stop. I brought my gelatos, but I didn't even use them, but that's okay. Maybe I will get out here for a little bit tonight, but maybe not because we have something going on after work. Okay, but I did get a lot more put in, and this journal is almost done. We'll leave this open so it can dry. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you to new subscribers, and I will see you soon. Bye for now.